guys, Edge here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to use the Discord bot, Couch bot. I've seen two tutorials on how to use this, but one was in Portuguese and the other was in some other language. So, uh, yeah guys, let's go ahead and get right into it. First thing you want to do, go ahead and uh, invite it to your server. You want to go ahead and keep everything checked here and go ahead and click the server that you want it to be at and go ahead and authorize it. I'm not a robot. Alright, so now you want to go ahead and head over to Discord. And as you can see, Couchbot just joined. Also, in this tutorial, I'm only going to be focusing on YouTube, seeing as there's already a bunch of Discord bots that are being used for Twitch. So, like I said, guys, only doing YouTube for this video. But if y'all really want me to do a Twitch video, go ahead and let me know down in the comments, and I will gladly oblige. So these are the commands that we're going to be using. So these commands are going to be showing notifications for streaming and videos. And that's pretty much it. But uh, there's also a bunch of other commands. I'll leave a link to the whole command list. But anyways guys, first things first. You're going to want to go ahead and type in CB YouTube ad. I'm just going to be copying and pasting this because uh, it's a lot faster. But it doesn't matter if you type it. So if you're wondering where you find this, this is actually your channel ID. So you want to go ahead and head over to YouTube, and if you look up here, right on your URL, look right after channel, after the slash, this is your channel ID. You want to go ahead and copy that, and then paste that right after add, and then enter. So now it's added to the YouTube streamer list. Next thing you're going to do is you want to allow the notifications for live streams, but before you do this, you want to go ahead and make a specific text channel just for live streams. I mean, you can always have it be sent to uh, uh, general, but I like to keep my stuff organized, so we're going to go ahead and make that. We're also going to make a videos one. Because like I said, we, I like to keep it organized. I don't know about y'all, but I don't want all my notifications being sent to the general chat. Yeah. So now that we have these text channels over here, go back to this. Or... Uh, I'll go back to this and you want to go ahead and type in CB channel live and then you're gonna have this whatever text text channel your live streams are you want to have this the notifications being sent there so you're gonna go ahead and press enter or enter <laughs> and now the notifications will be able to be sent to the live streams text channel And then next command is going to be CB allow live. So this will actually like, I'm pretty sure this is like you can make it false if you don't want the notifications to be sent anymore. But true is making sure that all the notifications are always sent. So you want to type in CB allow live true. So this will allow the notifications for live streams to be sent. So now we have all the live streaming done. So with this, now let's say you go live, your audience will now receive like a notification in the live streams text channel saying that you just went live. But that's not all, we're going to go ahead and head back to this. So if y'all don't know what this is, I'm going to go ahead and show y'all Nick A30 seeing as he uses the same Discord bot. Uh, let's go ahead and head over to live streams. So basically, this message, oh sorry. This message right here, this is what's going to also be sent with the URL for your live stream. So, as you can see, this would be Nick A30 just went live and he added a game. And then this is the title, and uh, that's the URL. So, you want to go ahead and type in the same exact thing with the percentages and the caps. And it must be surrounded in quotes, or else it will not work. Now y'all know why I'm copying and pasting because this would take a long time to type out. <laughs> so yeah, this is the specific message I want. You can change this to whatever. Like you could add like with friends fries. All right, <laughs> but uh, yeah, stuff like that. And uh, that's basically what's going to be sent with the live stream uh, URL. And there you go. So now we're fully done with the live streaming. 
Um, I think we're gonna go ahead and move on to the videos. If you only wanted to do live streaming, feel free to leave. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get into the videos. All right. So basically, these are gonna be the notifications for when the channel posts videos. So we're gonna go ahead and wanna type in this. You're gonna wanna type in CB channel published videos. So uh, this area right here is gonna be the text channel for videos. So when you po post a video on your channel, it's gonna be sent to this text channel in specific or whatever text channel you have it set to. Press enter, all right. And it's the same thing with this one. You have to allow the notifications to be sent. So you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and type in CB allow publish true. Next up, it's the same thing with the messaging. Like, here, let me go ahead and paste it. You can put whatever you want in these quotes. And these must, these quotes and percentages must be here, all right? Like, in these percentages, it's gonna put your channel name. You don't have to type it yourself. It, it puts it there already. And the title's already gonna be put there when you're uploading. And uh, so will the URL. All you need to do, this is the message right here. You can put anything else, but do not get rid of these percentages and uh, the caps. Go ahead and enter that. Let's see. All right, now we're on the final step. So with all these messages being sent, basically your audience is seeing, they're only seeing this right now. Only this part right here. So that seems a bit boring. So we're, I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all how to actually enable the thumbnails to be shown because thumbnails are meant to grab eyes and uh, you really wanna get the attention of the viewer. So let's go ahead and put that command on. You're gonna wanna type in CB allow thumbnails true and now every time a notification is sent to one of these text channels it will now include the th thumbnail from the live stream or the video that you just posted anyways guys that pretty much wraps it up there's a whole lot more commands and stuff to do but this is just the basics if you're a streamer or uh, just a regular youtuber um, this is the video for you Anyways, guys, I really hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Um, if you play Fortnite, use Edge in the item shop. And, uh, yeah, guys, it's been real. And peace.